Hey guys, what is up? Tyler Orion's Rock 50 here, back with another episode of Balloon Super Monkey 2. And where we left off, I was still having lots of struggles against the great Calamari boss, and today I'm hopefully gonna get past it. Um, besides the scenes, I did a bit of extra playing. I wouldn't really call it grinding, but I was like going for extra achievements and stuff. I replayed Monkey Lane a lot. See, here you see a bunch of 100% red blobs. Here I actually got diamond. Um, this is. Apparently, I should have diamond on two maps. I thought I only had it on one, but I have it on stage three and stage four monkey lane. Hopefully, I will have tutorials of that soon, and <laughs> I'm so close to getting this one achievement. 98% uh, red blops. Also, got a bit more upgrades. Um, left arm attack. All I really did was upgrade the elemental arc to uber flame now. It's the sixth tier, and it looks pretty boss. And what I'm saving up for now is the spiky burst, because I have heard the spike pulse core attack is pretty overpowered. So yeah, that is what I'm going for next. Let's give this Kalamari boss a piece of our mind. Alright, Deep Balloon Sea, stage number 5. Hope I can get through this this time and hopefully get to see Mount Magma. That, um, that fourth stage, or world, whatever you want to call it. Okay, yeah. But here we have all the stingrays and such again. Yeah, I've beaten all these already. Just got to get a ton of pops out of it. Because that actually one of my biggest struggles is actually just getting to the Kalamari boss. I mean, takes a lot of pops it definitely relies on me getting that golden balloon early on so i get the epic ability that is key if i don't get that i'm pretty much just screwed it's like no chance of me moving on if i don't get it here bunch of blobs and stuff too just flying on over i could use all these blobs yeah a bunch of upgrades once i get that spike bolt upgrade <laughs> man you balloons better watch out well it's like 8600 so that's a long way away Although the uh, final flame one costed more, though. <gasps> okay, here's the uh, go golden balloon. Let's see if I can get it now, then pop all these glass balloons. I think these are glass shields, actually. Oop, trapped again. <laughs> kind of. Okay, getting that gold balloon. Come on. Come on. Come on. <gasps> yes! Although, <laughs> I, this thing doesn't really have that much popping power. The wizard, I mean, it's helpful and all, but it doesn't have much popping power, so it's not going to help me much. No. Dang it, I was home for, hoping for something like the Sun God, because the Sun God just wrecks every single balloon out there in existence, period. <laughs> Dang, the Sun God's overpowered. That wizard, nah, it helped, maybe. I don't know, it really didn't seem to do that much, though. It didn't, I don't know, I don't like it. It wasn't very friendly. I wish I got a Sun God. Whatever, I'm going to, you know, give us a couple tries, though. In the end, though, I hopefully will beat the Calamari boss. I've had a lot of glitches with it in, in trying to record past in, in past recordings. So, like, there was there's like a deleted recording I have where I got to Calamari boss twice, but lost the first time because it basically just exited the screen five seconds and it said it lost. I'm like, well, okay, screw that. Second time I played it, it shows off like way off to the left, and um, I guess I'm technically able to pop it, but I'm just sitting there and going on forever. So. Yeah, a bunch of glitches. Hopefully, they'll fix it and stuff. And this part's kind of odd, really. Um, Here. Oh, yes, yeah, right. Go for the Moabs and stuff. And hopefully, I can get a BFB. And wow, did I decimate that Moab, like, quickly. Holy bejeebus. These glass balloons, glass shields pushing me around are kind of annoying. I know uh, Chris says um, the shields are glass balloons. I I I'm guessing he's learned by now, but, like, the 50s of comments on that video. But, yeah. Yeah, I can, I can tell the difference. The reason why I'm just saying glass, because these are glass and shield balloons. I mean, they're clear like that, and they push me around, so that's not fun. Alright, I'm nearing 10,000 pops, though, for the level. Good. Pretty good, I guess. Let's go for this Moab again. Hopefully, I'll be able to pop the BFB, because that is, like, needed since I didn't get too much pops from that epic golden balloon ability. So, yeah, I'm going to have to just kind of keep going off these green balloons on the side. Green shields, kind of keep pushing up, get a bunch of red blobs from them, because, you know, I haven't really touched these before. And I'm actually able to go through them pretty well. I'm kind of hitting them both on both sides, getting almost all of them total. Man, I wonder what it will be like when I get that spike pulled upgrade. You balloons just better watch out. Another Moab, let's take this buddy down. Bye-bye, dude. <laughs> you, you're bad. He's, he's bad. He's a bad guy. This bullseye of glass... Shield balloons is kind of getting annoying to be honest. Just be completely honest. I mean, it's nice for the game and stuff. Nice to make it challenging. 
but it, I don't like getting pushed around. It's not fun. Stop pushing me, man. It's not cool. It's bullying. And we don't accept bullying here. <gasps> Here's the BFB. Okay. Fo focus all of my energy and power onto this BFB because it is top priority to take this down. I better get this BFB because it will give me a ton of pops and stuff. You know, I'll be worth it. Hopefully. If only this, uh, this glass thing would stop pushing me away. No, I gotta hit it. All right, I'm d got it down to bandage stage. How much more will I have to go? There's like, there's actually another stage after this, I guess. Where like, yeah, it's getting cracked. Where, where you see like the left motor have a bandage on it. I believe that is its last stage, if I remember correctly. Okay, I think it's got it down to its last stage. It's gonna pop this time. There's no way it can't. It's like at the bottom. Yes, I got it. I got it. I got it. Actually, it did not give me as many uh, balloons as I thought, though. Huh. Alright, let's just focus down these moabs then. Get the pops from here. Alright, but it was nice to get the BFB, but I'm still 7,000 pops short. And there, um, I don't know, there's not too many balloons left. I just gotta focus down jelly, 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 jelly balloons. Jellyfish. And all the balloons underneath. Just focus on the balloons, not the blobs, because the balloons are high importance here. Most of these blobs I've gotten already. There's just blue blobs at the moment, so yeah, I don't care too much about them, to be completely honest. I care more about popping these balloons, because there's a decent amount of them here. Um, focus down the balloons. Hopefully my flame and my darts, all that can team up together and work together to get bunches and bunches of pops. I'm not doing too bad, but now it gets kind of tough, because these slug things are going to push me around and be total bullies and stuff, and jerks, jerkaholics. No, get back here. Let me back on the screen, you jerks. No, 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 I'm stuck. Okay. Oh, no, not these alien guys again. Ah, stealing my blops. And granted, not that I care, but at least they don't steal, like, pops from me. Man, that would really suck. Yeah, okay, quit chasing me, man. Okay, I'm actually really close to 20,000 pops, though. I have almost a thousand to go, but it's going to be close, and I actually don't think I'm going to get it. So I'm going to be, like, a couple hundred short. Oh, man, all that's left is the aliens now. Ah, oh, dang. Why do I have to get such a bad, um, bad, um, frick? A bad uh, ability from the golden balloon. That's, like, basically what this depends on right now, because I haven't done too much farming yet. I still don't have any epic abilities yet. So, yeah, there goes all the UFO balloons. And I failed so close. Man, under a thousand left to go. All right, this time. This is the beauty of just replaying. I'm glad I don't have to start the whole game over again, because that would just majorly suck. <laughs> yeah, I get to keep trying at this, keep cracking at it, and one day eventually I should get it. Hopefully this video, though. I mean, because granted, I mean, I get, almost got it with kind of a sucky um, um, ability thing from the gold b balloon. So yeah, let's see if, you know, maybe if I get something slightly better. I don't know, which is kind of likely. That's how I'll hopefully be able to pass it this time. Just focus down as many balloons as humanly possible. These greens should should give a lot of pops. I'm almost at 3,000 right now. That's pretty darn good. I swear, though, once I get that spike pult, it, it'll almost be, like, too easy. I wonder if I'll be able to beat the game without, like, any epic upgrades. That'd be pretty sweet. I gotta remember, though, flamethrower. The flamethrower is actually missing quite a bit. Gotta remember the flamethrower is focused on the left side. I have to have make sure that hits the balloons. That golden balloon just running around. Oh, I got you. Okay, okay. Shoot the glass shield balloons. And I'll shoot everything else. Yes, lots and lots of pops. Holy bajeebus. Yes. And now a bunch of pops left over for me to not really get. So, ooh, squids. I'm almost at 10,000 pops. This is excellent. Just burn three squids right now. Sweet. Wow, that, that was a ton of pops. Rambo dartling gun. That's why I like to call it. It's a Rambo. Alright, sweet. We are at the greens area with 11,000 pops in our belt, under our belt. So I think we are kind of set right here. Th this is going to be the um, run that I make it to the calamari boss. The only problem is, will I beat it? Because it is actually a really tough boss. Not gonna lie. With so many balloons surrounding it. Frick! Oh my gosh, I completely real forgot something. I actually know of a really good trick. Um, um, cool guy in forums told me, uh, Michael, um, not going to really say his last name, if that is his last name, but if if he, if he the name on his forums is his last name, I'm not going to make it too public, but it's Michael who told me, 
he told me this really good trick for um, defeating the Kalamari boss, and I totally forgot to carry it out. If I fail this time, I'm going to go in one more time with the trick and hopefully be able to pull it off. So here is the Moeb. I'm going to focus it down. All right, I might as well tell you what the trick is now. How it works... Wait, hold on. Let me actually... No. Store, maybe. Nope. Oop, nope, didn't want that. How it works is that before the game, you get this, um, the freezy power-up. Like, the one that freezes all balloons around you in a short area. And you freeze the black shield balloons covering, covering the calamari boss. And when the, um, balloons are away, they're all frozen and stuff. Then you just basically shoot, focus down the calamari boss and you win. And it's, like, too easy. So, yeah, I'm definitely gonna try that out in this video. But I totally forgot to do it this time. Totally forgot it existed. Should have thought about this beforehand, but I didn't. Oh well. I don't know. I'm still gonna, you know, give this a couple tries and stuff. Focus on that Moab, get a bunch of pops out of it. And now I kinda go back into these greens and stuff. Bunch of pops from these two. These shield glass balloons are still pushing me around like a bunch of meanies. Because they're jerks and stuff. And I don't like them really that much, to be completely honest. <laughs> well, I mean, who does like them? <laughs> Alright, almost uh, 16,000. There is another Moab. I'm just going to kind of work my way up to him. Almost 16,000. Sweet. <laughs> Let's focus him down. Do I actually get a popping bo bonus for, like, popping the shell of Moab? Do I get, like, 100 pops from that, maybe? I don't know. That'd be nice to know. If anybody knew, like, for sure, I don't know. Let me know. That'd be great to know. Holy crap. My guy just got pushed out of the screen. He's getting pushed around and bullied like crazy. He's getting bullied, man. <laughs> Is that one kid? I guess he just gets bullied a lot. All right, let's kind of work my way back into here. Get a bunch of these greens still off. And here is the BFP. Focus down that BFP. <laughs> and hopefully I should win. <laughs> I'm going to pay attention to my pops once I pop that BFP. And see if there's like a big significant dis difference. It was pretty close though last time uh, to popping the BFP. Let's see how close I get this time. Uh, quit pushing me around glass shields. No, just yeah, let me pop the thing. Alright, got a single bandage on the right side. Now I just gotta get... Next stage is cracks on the... Uh, Alright, yeah, the cracks. And now the there's one more stage bandage on the uh, left sh left motor. Oh boy, this is gonna be really cutting it close. It got down to its last stage now. But how long will it stay in its last stage? I don't know. Oh boy, it's gonna take quite a few hits. Oh boy, and I got it to explode. Sweet. Bunch of free pops for me. I actually think I would have gotten more pops though if I just focused on the green. But you know, it's always good to go for the BFB. I don't know. I, I just like going for BFBs. And I have 18,000. There is no doubt in my mind that I will pop pass this level this time. Which is great. Excellent, excellent. There's a lot of balloons coming up now. And it would be pretty sad if I didn't um, get to the Kalimari boss. There are just too many balloons in this area. Now I can almost focus on blobs instead of balloons. I mean, not quite focus on them, but if I see any red blobs, then I'll just go on my way to get those. Oops. There we go, bronze. So we do know the Kalimari boss is coming up, guys. There we go, progress. This is probably one of the harder levels in the game, though. 3-5, the Kalimari boss. Not even only getting to it is hard, but defeating the boss itself is pretty hard. It's going to take a good amount of grinding. Granted, I didn't... I guess, I mean, I was playing it. It may count as grinding, but really, it was just like... I was trying to get to, you know, the diamond achievement and the 100% uh, blop achievement. And I end up, did get those for, like, single stages, but I still need to get them for an entire world. Um, and once I do that, I'm going to focus down the aliens, though. Because they're, they'll just be stealing my blops left and right, and they are jerks. Quit doing that such thing. Stop it. Stop it, guys. Seriously. Stop it. Stop it. Stay away. There we go. Keep blowing them up one by one. There are lots and lots of aliens here, though. You, you keep flying around and stuff. Why do you keep stealing my blops? That ain't nice. Oh, and here he is, the massive calamari boss. Lots of balloons. I am getting pushed around by this shield thing. This is probably the hardest part about the level. The shield thing that keeps pushing me around. That is a total jerk right there. Probably the biggest meanie I've ever faced. Um, unfortunately, you cannot freeze that jerk um, uh, thing that pushes you around. Unfortunately, you cannot freeze him, um, because uh, just more will come. But you can freeze the black balloons covering the Kalamari boss, which is nice. So I'm going to keep focusing these down. Why do you keep pushing me around? All right, whatever, that's fine. I can manage. Kalamari boss stays for a while, which is good. 
Um, I gotta make sure though my poppage is not focused on the uh, balloon thing that's chasing me around because there are a lot of balloons in there. I bet a lot of my poppage would go towards there. Just let me focus the calamari boss. Oh, there's two of them. They're oh my gosh, there are two separate things chasing me around. I saw they kind of split up at times. That, wow, this is evil. They're like quartering me like a scared child or something. I don't know, but I am quite unmasking it this time. <laughs> like the last video, <laughs> I didn't even know it was a boss. I'm like, oh, wait, this is a boss. Holy poop. Okay. I, I didn't even realize. Okay, but yes, it is almost uncovered this time. So I just kind of keep circling it. And then as soon as the face and eyes are uncovered, I can keep focusing on that. He's still high up on the screen. He's not going down still. I mean, granted, I guess he's halfway down. So I'm, I'm making good progress is what I meant to say. Maybe, no, I'm not going to be able to buy the uh, next uh, dart core during this level, unfortunately. But, okay, he's almost completely exposed now. I I'm not quite sure how tough he is once he's completely exposed, though. I wonder how much health he, the boss himself actually has. I mean, Mr. Boss Man. Alright, but yeah, a lot of his health is in those black shield balloons surrounding him. Of course, there's like a ton of glass shield balloons like right over his eye. I, I've actually made him crack right now, so he's cracked. Okay, good. Just keep focusing him down. Keep it focused. Focused. Just keep shooting at him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stupid balloon pushing him around. That's probably, like I said before, it's the hardest part of the whole level. Dealing with that balloon that's just push, Balloon cluster that's just pushing me around. What a jerk. And we can basically see the entire Kalamari boss right now. So... Yeah, this is what he looks like. An interesting looking boss. Um, you know, appropriate for underwater level. Just looks like a giant sea creature, I guess. I don't even think I'll get silver, though. I don't care, personally. Um, all that matters to me is popping this calamari boss. Did I get rid of all the balloons? I'm so close to getting rid of all the balloons on him. And then I can pretty much just focus him down. I've got him cracked even more. He is so close... Alright, there goes all the balloons on him. So just freaking focus him down. Ignore the guy pushing me out of the way, I guess. Just focus on cracking him. Hopefully I can pop him, maybe. He doesn't take too many hits, I noticed. Oh my gosh. This thing pushing me around, though, is actually getting really annoying. It's kind of starting, like, just a tad. Just a little bit. Holy crap, he's getting towards the bottom of the screen now. He's starting to go down. And he's going down pretty fast, so I gotta pop him fast um use good micro to evade the thing that's chasing me kind of keep moving myself you see, you see that you see that did you see two different shields there's two different shield guys chasing me which is actually incredibly annoying so i gotta kind of keep myself moving don't let them push me around but like um you know make sure i still stay on top of him while moving around oh boy big crack over the mouth i think i'm not sure if that's a mouth or just him being cracked oh boy this is gonna be cutting it close maybe Either that, or I'm nowhere even close to popping him. Um, the top part of him isn't even cracked, so this does not look good. But luckily, he'll kind of stay near the bottom for a while, so I can kind of keep going at him just for a bit. Um, I don't know. When's he going? Am I anywhere near close to popping him? Oh my gosh, this boss is hard, I swear. What an evil boss. I mean, it's evil because the balloon that's chasing me. What a jerk. I wish I could get more hits on him. Oh, nope, he's going by. There he goes, I think. Oh, darn. And I don't think I passed this time around, guys. Yeah, he got by. That stinks. All right, one last try. dun da da dun dun da However, I'll be using the trick I've been taught. Snap freeze. All right. Let's see if this works. And it could be useful against, like, you know, other stuff throughout the level. It did cost 600 blops, or cash, though. Which is actually quite a bit, you know. You know, that's 600 more cash. I have to wait until, um, frick, until, um, getting the, uh, spike bolt thing. So, yeah. Alright, focus down. Make sure my, uh, flamethrower is hitting most, doing most of the damage. Not quite the darts. Flamethrower just wrecks everything, so I gotta, I'm gonna use that. That's pretty powerful. I'm not quite sure what the difference between this, uh, 6 tier up upgrade and the 5th tier upgrade were. I mean, they their icons are like exactly the same but I wonder what the difference is so yeah almost 3500 yep 3500 balloons already 
up to 4,000 already just on these manta rays. Wow, unheard of. 4,500 even. And we are getting there. All right, yep. There we go. 4,600 by the time I see the golden blue. Which is good progress. You. Frozen. See, see, look at that. These guys are frozen. I can't chase. <gasps> yes, Sun God. Yes. Instant win. Instant win. Sun God decimates every freaking thing. Yes, Sun God. Oh, baby. <laughs> ah, yes. So many blobs, too. Focus on these squids, too. I'm actually going to get all those. And I'm at freaking 15,000. I mean, would you believe that? Holy bejeebus. All right, so now I'm going to just focus down these green balloons, too. Shields, and sh very shortly, I should be um up to, um, frick, up to 20,000. See, so yeah, I got to remember to use the trick on the Kalamari boss. Hopefully, it should make life slightly easier for me. That'll be nice. I'm actually going to freeze this now. Oh, 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 I've se I actually separated this. I'm going to go for this, then. Yeah, I, I just got rid of the center. Yeah, might as well just focus down uh, balloons I haven't gotten before. She seems like a shelp up and is back. The uh, snap freeze though does a lot against those glass shields though. So actually, yeah, I definitely recommend it. It seems to be help so f helpful so far. Wow, yeah, yeah. When I freeze those, it just decimates them. And now they're not even in sync. They just <laughs> they just went away. And I got that mo up too. I am at eighteen thousand pops. GG. I think those are shield ceramics underneath. Yeah, a bunch of uh bunch of us money is from that well, let's see see how many of these shield ceramics I can freeze focus down the Moab now in the meantime I'm gonna want to focus shoot at those uh, ceramics though pretty soon they're just running away because they know that they've been unoriented I guess I guess this, I kind of like how that code works if like you know some shape has been disoriented it flees oh yeah I destroyed that Moab so quickly and now guess what I'm about to get bronze Wait for it, bronze, this early on. I mean, wow, that, that's really early on. Now I just focus down these fleeing balloons. Don't mind if I do. And then I can, like, focus down the ceramics as soon as I get um, the um, ability back. Uh, yeah, I actually love the snap freeze thing, guys. Excellent, excellent trick. And thank you so much to Michael for telling me that. He kind of showed it off to everybody in the Blue Wolves clan, which is another reason why Blue Wolves is best clan. We've got lots of awesome people in there, like Michael. So, yeah. Much more pop is, poppings and stuff. But yet, these glass shield target things will keep coming back, despite the fact I keep freezing them. I guess there usually has to be, like, one on screen at all times. See, so yeah, I'll freeze it. Why not? Yeah, that's right. Frozen. Oh, and there's the BFB. Let me see, will this thing freeze a BFB? I've kind of wondered that. I'm going to wait for the ability to come back, then I'll try to freeze the BFB. It does not freeze the BFB, unfortunately. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool, frozen BFB just sitting there. That'd be sweet. Oh, I made that disintegrate. And now I see a bunch of um, shield ceramics. Kind of annoying me. Alright, so let's see if I can keep getting this down to its lower stages, I guess. Um, alright, cracks, final stage, and this is going to be cutting it close again. Alright, get ready, and pop! Yes, sweet. Freeze, whoa. Okay, did I just get rid of, like, all those glass balloons at once or something? Or Holy crud. Okay, there's a lot of uh, balloons on screen, though. I think the glass balloons, like, scattered. Shield glass balloons, they are. They scattered like crazy. Okay, I'm feeling it, guys. This is going to be the level where I win. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> so I'm going to keep the um, a freeze ability on me for when the slugs come. Because when the slugs come, that is when I'll use it. I'll freeze the slugs so they stop annoying me. And I'm able to focus down the tentacles of these jelly, 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 jellyfish. <laughs> I have a bit of allergies right there. My bad. Okay. And get a bunch of these balloons and stuff. And here comes the slugs. You, freeze. What? It kept moving? No. Why would they keep moving? I froze them. Oh, that, that, that sucks. Okay, it seems that some of the... <laughs> they're deteriorating. They're going away. Alright, just focus on the aliens. Just because. 
It's not, I don't like seeing them take my blocks. That ain't cool, bro. That ain't cool. Nobody likes that. Why you steal my blops, bro? Not cool. Not cool at all. Freeze. Oh, and here's the Kalimari, bo Kalimari boss. Um, this is where I just gotta freeze everything. Gotta wait for that ability to come back, but once I do, it'll, I will freeze into him. And hopefully this trick should work. Then I'll have like a lot of time to attack his actual body. Hopefully take him down. When's it coming back though? Hope it recharges. Oh, it's recharged. Oh, dang. Okay, yeah, that was pretty effective. <laughs> Took off like his whole face and now it just deteriorates. Goes away. Sweet. Unfortunately, that thing will keep chasing me. But I got some pretty, um, I got pretty far ahead on uh, taking off his face. I shall, but I just gotta use it a couple more times. When it comes back around, do I have it right now? I think I do. Oh, dang. Holy crud. Let's see. It's kind of in like a cradle right now. Let's see if... Okay, let's see if I can get inside this cradle. It'll, if it just stops pushing me around. Now, just focus on his face. Holy crud. Um, okay, yeah. I'm pretty much done. Let's see if I'm able to freeze the thing that's chasing me. I know I've heard I can't, but... That I can't. Yeah, I'll just keep moving, unfortunately. Whatever. But yeah, I've cleared his face pretty early on now, much faster than last time, because that helped awesome trick. Oh wait, I guess I did freeze him, but then another one comes, which kind of stinks. I'll keep using the freeze ability as it shows up and stuff, but it's saddening to know they'll always be pushed around. That's never fun. I don't like being bullied like that. But I think I'll be bullied by a bit less stuff. Only one of, only half the amount of balloons will be pushing me around then. Granted, it doesn't really make a difference. But they're still pushing me around, which isn't fun. Alright, I've got him down one stage, alright? I don't know what his last stage looks like, which is kind of an issue. Wish I knew what his last stage looked like. So I knew when I was close. Alright, I froze the freezing thing again. Alright, I got him down another stage. Okay, so he does not have a mouth, technically. So if I freeze... Um... It, well, if I see, like, you know, a big mouth forming, then I know he's down to a pretty low stage. That is good to know. I do like having indication of how well I'm doing. Oh, frick, I had a freeze ability, but I wasn't able to use it successfully. Darn. Failed. Granted, it's not really helping much. Alright, but it seems that... Oh, there's the mouth. Okay, is this his last stage? That'd be pretty great. Using some pretty decent micro to avoid that thing chasing me and pushing me around. It's not cool, but this is starting to get towards the bottom of the screen. This is going to be really close, actually. Oh boy, please pop this time, Calamari boss. Please, be a ge kind gentleman, fellow, and just pop for me, okay? Pop. Okay, and there's another stage. Oh, crap. Actually, I still have quite a few stages to go. Oh, am I not being pushed around anymore? I'm not being pushed around. Okay. <gasps> I got it! I got it! Oh, la, la, la. Yes, I think I got it. Please don't tell me there's a glitch now. <gasps> yes, I did it, guys. Stage 5 complete, the Kalimari boss. Thank you so much, Michael, for that tip. That definitely helped a ton. Whew. Stage 5 complete. Finally got that. Well deserved. And a nice episode, too. So that is about it, guys. That is the Kalimari boss and how to beat it. Excellent, excellent tip. Uh, if you haven't beaten it, I would definitely suggest trying that yourself. See if it works, because it definitely did for me. So that's about it, guys. Thanks all you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Please do show your support if you did enjoy. And that's about it. Peace, guys.